Hello everybody, welcome back to another Bakugan vlog post Today I have uh, more puzzles Let's go! Oh, this is the Mutant Helios It's still sealed Quite cool They actually gave me a nice case Yes, this was the one I was waiting for The box is a bit dirty Okay let me switch the camera angle Okay, let's start So, uh, this one is loose So I'll start with this first This is a Pyrus Moonlight um, Monaris Yeah, I bought one previously before yeah. Yeah, It's not, not as good condition as the other, the other one Okay, anyway, this Moonlight Monaris Oh, it looks like a Baku Solar Yes, it is a Baku Solar It's an Aquas Baku Solar Aquas Baku Solar L tier the magnet doesn't be doesn't seem to be working very well. Yeah, you see, it's not sticking to the metal. I wonder if I can get uh, replacement magnets. Anyway, this is uh, Aquas Baku Solar L tier. Okay. Okay, this. I already had this uh, in the pack, but I saw this loose, so I thought I'd get another one. Okay, so this is Diamond Superiors from Baku Evolutions. Let's see how it opens. Yeah. I think this this mall looks very nice. Yeah, looking nice. Let's take a look at this first. B1, uh, Ventus B1s. So this is a open open call. So previously in Battle, Battle Brawlers in the first generation, the calls were open, meaning that they exposed the magnet. So this is a Ventus uh, Skyrus. Ventus Skyrus B1. I think they are pretty rare. I'm not sure how rare, but it's, I guess it's pretty rare. I'm not sure what is this. This is uh, also open call Ventus. Uh, non non painted. This is non painted. Gorum? Yeah, I think it's Gorum. Okay, so let's move this back. Yeah, a couple of platinums here. The prototypes. Okay, let's start with this. This looks very nice. I think it's a prototype of some uh, diamond. It, it looks like it's glowing. Is this. Colossus? Looks like Colossus. Oh. I can hear the, the, the sound, it's really very heavy. Yes, it is Colossus. Yeah, the paint looks like it's like fading off, but it still looks very nice. Very cool looking Bakugan. Oh, this is Neotrox. So as you can see from here, the metallic part is only the tail and the head. The top of the head actually, but it's really very little metal. I would have expected this part to be metal as well but yeah only the tail and the top of the head quite disappointing Neotrox yes this is another this is another Neotrox uh, prototype wow it's stuck you need to knock back the this piece here anyway this is a uh, Trox Neotrox red color prototype yeah the orange one actually had a chip portion uh, the, something was broken here Let's draw all these prototypes. Very easily broken. Black piece. Shakta. Did I buy Shakta? I don't remember buying Shakta. It's weird. Hmm, who is this? It doesn't seem like the licks are. Oh, how cool. Yeah, it looks very weird. So the metallic washing is the center. Looks like it's broken. Is it broken? Looks very loose. Yeah, it was very loose. Okay, I tightened the head. So this is uh Neo Halko, I believe. Neo Halko. I don't know whether he'll be releasing in in evolutions or not. So yeah, let's let's try closing it up again. Yeah, the legs not closing very well. I don't know whether this is the final design. It's very weird for uh, design. Yeah. Halko, Neo Halko. Ooh, looks like a diamond. A lot of these are stuck. Hegatrix seems to be stuck in this position. Yeah, I, I think I need to, to dig inside flat surface to open it up. Yeah, never mind. I just leave it like that. Hegatrix. And this is the last one. Who is this? Such a big hollow piece. Is something missing? I'm guessing something is missing. It doesn't look very... Who is this? Okay, this is Hydra's. Without the head. It looks quite creepy. Without the head. I can screw here. Yeah, I don't know how to open it up, but anyway. Yeah, this is a Hydra's without the head. I think the head got broken off. The uh, screw is a bit loose also. But as you can see how, how it's, it's actually 
connected together. The, there's a screw here that actually binds this portion to the metal. There's another screw here. So these, these parts are actually all separate. So by right, you need to use a L-shaped screw to take this out. If you want, if you want to disassemble it. This is just weird. Yeah, the head is broken. This is weird. Okay, never mind. I don't remember getting Shakta. Maybe you mixed up. Okay, okay, so let's see the rest. So this is part of a lot that I got together with this box. This is um, Milton Helios, I believe the lava version, lava storm version. It's sealed. Very difficult to get this, this sort of stuff sealed. I'll probably keep it, I already have this, so keep it sealed. Okay, and the stuff that I'm looking for, this box looks so dirty. Okay, let's go one by one. This is Infinity Helios, Pyrus Infinity Helios. Feels a bit weighty, maybe it's metal. Okay, Pyrus. Infinity Helios. This is Krakenite. Yeah, this is a uh, Milton Krakenite. Milton Krakenite. Another one. And also the Helios uh, variation of this. This is a Milton Helios. Milton Helios. Milton Helios. No, oh, there was another Milton Helios. Same as the that that package here. Milton Helios Milton Helios And this is a Subterra Fusion Dragonoid Comes with the Baku Snap A lot of these don't come with this The snaps Cause people lose them Oh, oh. Ah. Okay, anyway Fusion Dragonoid hmm. This is a This is a Subterra Trembler Baku, It's a Baku Steel version so when you land, it actually does this. I, I've shown this before. Uh, so it only gets triggered when it hits one of these points. See, when I hit it, it flew off. It's quite quite cool gimmick. But not many of these were made. Okay, Baku Steel Trembler. So this is a Darkest Bakugo Vertex. I already have one of these, but the previous time I went to search for this, it, it took quite a while to find. Darkest Bakugo Vertex. Very, very nice looking Bakugo. Okay, oh, this is metal. This is a Milton Krakenoid. Milton Krakenoid. The Pyrus top and Darkest bottom. Yeah, that's one thing I don't like about all these mutants. They come in all these uh, mixed colors. This, this is also metal. Feel the weight. The top looks like a Pyrus Bakugo. Bottom looks like a Darkest. What is this? Oh, crawl. Yep, it's a crawl. Again, mixed colors. Not very fond of this. Okay, so this is a Subterra Bakugo Mutant Crowd. This is a full, same same design. Yeah, opens quite nicely as well. Yes, it's a nice, nicer piece. Okay, and a Pirates Bakugo version. Same thing. Yes, Mutant Crowd. Okay, and the start of the show, the last piece that I've been looking for and searching for for quite a while. As you can see, the dead, dead stem is uh, here. So this is a Subterra Warton. I've been trying to find this for a very long time. Okay, so... Yeah, Subterra Warton. Looking very, very cool. Oops, no! So if there's a Subterra Warton, I previously had a I previously had a Subterra Ballista here. I got this a long time ago. I never had the uh, Warton Warton portion. This is the Ballista. Yes. So together, the colors are a little bit off. Maybe it's just due to the production uh, factories and all that. Okay. So you open up the shoulder padding. Or whatever this call, and the head comes out, goes on top of this ballista, hands out, yeah. And we have Subterra Val Chaos. Cool, right? Very, very tall Bakugan combined. So, this has been my vlog post for today. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy this content, please click the like button and subscribe. See you next video. Thanks. Bye.